Despite recent snowfall, Oklahoma still finds itself with 16 counties with a fire warning due to the dry conditions and high wind. But could we see rain this weekend? Stay tuned for your U Central weather update to find out. Good evening, everybody. We've had a very warm and dry day. Today we had 16 counties in some sort of fire warning. About 12:15, we had a grass fire spark near the area of Interstate 240 and Center Road as well. Firefighters say that on days with extreme fire danger that the public should not throw flammable items or cigarette butts on the ground. Currently, 71 degrees, partly cloudy with a south to southeast wind of 10 miles per hour. Feels like 71 with the humidity up at 47 degree, 47 percent. Looking at our statistics, today we were high of 75. Normally we see 54, a low of 47, normally 31. Record was 81 back in 1954. Looking across the United States, 49 in San Francisco, you see this cool front pushing on the north. Very warm down here in the south, 74 in Dallas, 75 in New Orleans, 77 in Miami. Looking at the national radar, a few showers in California, a little bit of snow up in North Dakota, but Midwest is kind of playing. This might make its move this weekend. Chances still are very, very slim. Tonight, 56 clear skies, south to southwest winds at 8 miles per hour. Tomorrow, 73 degrees, part of the clouds could be another warm day. Tonight, 27 in Guyman, 39 in Enid, 56. It's going to be a little warmer. Might be nice to whip out the shorts and the T-shirt for tonight. Tomorrow, 60s, 70s across the state. 60s is going to be your cool spot. And Guyman, 71 in Macalester. Mainly clouds. East side of the state is going to be a few more clouds than here in the Midwest. Looking at the five-day forecast, 75 on Saturday, 30% chance of showers on Sunday with a high of 74, low of 42. Monday, it's going to cool down just a bit at 55, but Tuesday, we're back up to 59. And looking towards the backside of next week, it's going to get even warmer. That's your new central weather update. Back to the desk.